Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Enter the Gungeon. My name is Dun Money. This is episode 24, uh, and we are going to floor one. And the reason we're going to floor one, I've taken the pilot this time, and he has a lockpick. And I need four keys, and I need like 180 bullets. Like, I need a ton of money. Getting hit now doesn't matter. But uh, I need all that for the elevator guy. So I'm going to use the lockpick instead of my keys, because uh, I'm just not going to take the keys. I'm going to try not to spend any money. We'll see if that goes. But that means I need to get lucky and have some keys drop. Because I can't spend the money on keys. I need that money. The nice thing is now it's not quite as stressful as I think the last run was because of the fact that I, uh, I can take a hit and not worry about it. I was trying to get those three armors, man. That was high stress. That guy was coming after me. I'm gonna have to pretty much clear out the floors, I think, to try to get things to drop. That should be okay, though. Hey, we've got two keys. There's some progress. I mean, I can take some hits, but I'm taking a lot of hits. Like, I still have to survive. And he makes some bank, too, with the money. I think he's got a passive that actually increases the amount of money that drops. Which, for this elevator guy goal, is going to be really useful. Let's try it. It totally worked. Heavy boots. What does that mean? Low center of mass. Alright, we're going to check the Amonomicon, because I don't know what that means. Allows the Gungeoneer to keep their footing even when great force is applied to them. So those guys that bounce me around probably won't be able to bounce me around. I like that. I don't know if that's actually super useful, but, you know, anything counts. for this floor already? Did I clear it out? No, I gotta go check over there. I gotta do it. I mean, I have to get keys to drop and I have to get money, so I have to do it. Man, I don't like how low I am in life already. Where did that bat come from? I did not see him. I can't afford to buy anything. Despite the fact that I could really use more life. Okay. So I'm focusing on just dodging as much as I can. Man, I need some life to drop. I need some uh, keys to drop. Let's try it again. 
Got it. Alien sidearm. Okay, that's the entire floor. Well, let's go see if we can beat the boss without getting hit. Don't know if I can or not. I cannot. It's all right. I think we have a good strategy though. This guy is the right guy for this goal for the elevator. So we're just gonna quick restart, go right back in. Okay, let's try to do better and not actually, I was kind of playing a little willy nilly because I didn't care about getting hit, but I uh, obviously that's a bad strategy. money we need keys oh wow I exploded that barrel like the barrels they can be so helpful but I am more likely to have them blow up on me than I am to actually use them against an enemy effectively all right take that money We're doing okay. We've gotten one little hit off of us, but that's alright. I'm a little scared that I haven't gotten any keys to drop yet, but I've gotten some money. Okay, I took two little hits. Let's not take any more. There's a key. Two more keys. That was an easy room. Let's try it. Oops, I always do that. Nope. All right. Well, if you win some, you lose some. Blank. I'll take that. Okay, let's check this room. There's not a lot of... This isn't a hard room as far as enemies, but there's just a lot of them. Thinned it out. Wow, a lot of guys just spawn in a lot of mar grenades. Which I know I've mentioned before, but I hate the grenades. Alright. We're still doing okay. We still got two full hearts. Making good money. We got an extra key.
still feeling okay about this run. sword guy. Oh, I have a little cocoon here. Not a problem. Not a problem. Alright, let's go check this room. Probably another treasure box. Oof. Unlucky. One more area I gotta go explore. Ooh, I took a hit. Alright, in the shopkeep. Oh, I can't really buy anything, I don't know why I'm looking. How much is the key? It's only 21. Alright, that means I gotta make some more money, but I only need one more key to drop. So that might actually be a worthy trade-off. Oh, the trigger twins. I hate that I have to do this without a better gun. Gosh. Taking far too many hits. Son of a... the right strategy. Let's go again. Man. I have to just keep doing this until I eventually get it. I got unlucky there by not getting any better guns because I, I lost both lockpick rolls. I think part of it is just the luck of the draw. I mean, my skill is obviously a factor. But getting good equipment and, and getting good drops makes a big difference. I don't feel like I use the tables very effectively. But I think part of the reason is because I can't shoot through tables either. That, oh man, I don't put them up very often because of the fact that it stops me from hitting the enemy. Mr. Shopkeep, he's got a key. Is it 21 again? All right. We may buy that. Nice. Ooh, I like this weapon. Pitchfork is good. Get forked. So when I talk luck of the draw, this is kind of what I mean. The fact that I pulled this weapon and I got the lucky unlock, I mean, 
That gives me a much better shot here. There's the 21 I'm going to need for a key. I'll probably go buy that. More ammo. I would leave the ammo until I really need it, but there's a rat that comes by and steals my ammo if I leave it. the wrong way. Wow, this pitchfork is such a good weapon. So good, in fact, that I should probably be saving it for the boss, but... But I just love it so much. Got another treasure chest here. Nice. Shotgun cola. Speed up. Oh, I move faster. That's actually going to be very helpful. Alright, we've explored it. Let's go buy that key. I did not pull that much money on this floor. Unfortunately. And I didn't have a key drop. Two, two uh, negatives. Trigger twins. Took a hit. Another hit. I struggle with the trigger twins. Okay, now he's angry. He goes into berserk mode. That's all for the pitchfork, but he's pretty low. Another key dropped, and an extra life. Oh, two keys dropped. Alright, we got the keys, and we have a decent amount of money. And we gotta look like a good gun. Alright, we need to get through floor two. We need to not die. Uh, and we need to get some money. And you know what? I think that's a good place to leave this video. It's like a cliffhanger for the next episode. Will I make it? Spoiler alert, probably not. But let's find out. Thanks guys for watching this video of End of the Gungeon. My name's Dunmoney. And uh, please come back for the next episode. Bye, guys.